Hey guys, it's Chandra here. Um, today, I'm gonna give you kind of an update video. Um, <clears throat> sorry, there's something in my throat. Now, I think it was two days ago, we found a raccoon in our backyard, and he was just wandering through. He was just a baby. They say he's about eight or nine weeks, so he's definitely not ready to be away from his mother. And I named him Rocco, and uh, there was nobody around. It was the middle of the day, so his mom wouldn't have been around anyway, and we didn't know why he was there. And there was honestly no place for him to come from, so we called a wildlife place, and they told us to just take him in and care for him until they could get there, or whatever we planned to do with him. And I named him Rocco. He's so cute. I took videos and they'll be at the end of this. And to feed a raccoon, I don't think anybody realizes how hard it is. Because they don't just eat. You have to bottle feed them. And you have to bottle feed them cat's milk. Like, how the hell do you even get cat's milk? And it smells disgusting, by the way. Um, but he was super cute. And I didn't get any videos of feeding him because that would have been really difficult. And my mom doesn't like being on camera and it takes two people. Because one person's got to hold him and then the other person's got to feed them. Um, for anybody that's wondering, you don't touch them with your hands. You, we used a glove and a towel. And uh, we just stuck them in a tub and you'll see that in the video. I hope you guys can hear me. I probably should have turned that off first. I have made a parade's new album, Monsters in the Closet, playing right now. Oh, and I tried putting like a beauty light behind my camera, so I'm hoping that that is brightening up the area. I know in my last video it was kind of dark, um, but, but I thought I'd give you a little update. I loved Rocco. He was the greatest little thing ever. He's super duper small, and... Um, now he is with a wildlife center, I kind of want to say where it is, but then that'll give away where I am. Let's just say it's like two, no it's not, it's like six hours away. Um, and they were really, really nice, and they came and they picked him up, even though we're like six hours away. They came and they picked him up, and, uh, they said they'd take care of him, and they're going to feed him and get him stronger until he's a lot bigger and then they're just gonna let him go into the wild with a bunch of other raccoons that they have and I thought that was really cool um, I was really terrified that they would put them put him down or something and don't ever call animal control if you have a raccoon issue because they won't do anything they'll only do something if it's a really sick animal and they won't do it on Sundays just saying or Saturdays. Weekends, basically. We got them on Saturday. It's like Monday now, I think. It's Monday or Tuesday. Does anybody else have that problem when they're no longer in school that they don't remember what day it is anymore? Because that's me. I think I've been out of school for like a week or two. I think it's been two weeks, but I don't really know. Yeah. No. It's been a week. It's been two weeks. A week. I don't know. Um, I want to thank you all that have been helping me on my videos, by the way. I'm just going to add that in really quick. Um, those of you that have been helping me, leaving comments, it's been really great. I love you guys so much. Um, and I thought I'd just give you an update. I'm going to be uploading a video later. And then I'm going to be making another video later. So that'll be good. I'll get those up and I'll let you guys see the videos that I took of Rocco. Keep in mind they're not the best quality videos because I didn't really want to sh hit him with a bunch of light to scare him away or anything. But he is really cute and I took a lot of pictures of him and I'll insert them if I can. And yeah, I love you guys super duper much. Let's get to Rocco and bye! Hey guys! Somebody's waking up, and I think he wants to say hi. Rocco! Hi, Rocco. This is 
the little raccoon that we found in our yard. And yeah. I'll put this back on over him. He's been with us for a little bit now and we're gonna be putting him back to the wildness preserve thing. I'll get him in a second! Yeah, he's starting to wake up though. So we're gonna have to feed him and for those of you that don't know, feeding a raccoon is one of the most difficult things you can actually do with your life. Rocco! I named him like five seconds after we had to get him. Um, but his mom kind of abandoned him and we just found him in our yard. And we called some people and they're going to be getting him soon. Rocco! Want to say hi? We're thinking he's about 20 weeks. Let's see. Rocco! He's making little noises. Rocco's awake! Yeah, I have to go take out my dog now. Oh! The top just fell. Yeah! Rocco! Anyways, I have to go let my dog out, so bye! Rocco, Rocco say bye! Rocco say bye! You hear that? He's actually saying it. You can hear it. He's making little noises. Okay, bye! Hey guys, so we called the wildlife place again and they just told us to put him outside at dusk. So I guess we're going to do that and hope for the best, like put him in a crate and see if somebody comes to get him. We're pretty positive his mom died, but I don't know. We're going to hope that works. Because they say they're full on raccoons, so we don't know what to do. Isn't he cute though? Rocco! I think he's hungry, so we have to feed him. Um... We just feed him in this little bottle. It's like a baby bottle and it's cat's milk. Rocco. 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 <laughs> I think he's frustrated. He's hungry. He's hungry, so. We're gonna go feed him. Alright. Love you guys. Bye. Say bye, Rocco. Bye. Hey guys, so we just fed Rocco. Um, that was an interesting process. I'm sorry I didn't film it, I was going to, but then my mom was like, no, let's not. So I didn't. Um, but yeah, he's just super energetic right now. Um, in a couple hours, we're going to take him out to see if. He can get reunited with his mom. If not, there's another um, uh, rescue place for them. And we're going to see if they can figure out what to do with Rocco. Because we don't know what to do. Um, for those of you wondering, no, we're not touching him with our hands. And yes, I know that there's not supposed to be towels. But honestly, we didn't have anything else. And it's really bad outside it's like <laughs> really bad storm weather right now so we didn't want him to die out there so we just took him in and uh yeah I actually really like him I'm gonna miss him Baco hey. okay I'm not gonna miss the noises that he makes though because they're like really annoying my battery and my memory is almost dead, so I will film when we let him go, maybe, if it's light enough, because they don't come until, like, dusk to midnight, so. If they get reunited, I'll film it. Alright, bye guys. Just another update. Woo! Rocco. Rocco. You just ran inside. Alright, bye! Hey guys, so I hope you like the videos of Rocco. I know they're not the best quality, but I hope you see how adorable
adorable he is. Isn't he great? Um, I love you guys. I hope you enjoyed him. We have a super fantastical day, night, evening, wherever you are, wherever it is. Um, I love you guys. Stay rad, be cool, and I gotta go and bye.